In this video, I'm going to show you how to match colors across Microsoft Office documents. So whether you're using a Word document, a PowerPoint slide, or a spreadsheet, if you want to have the same consistent color that you use for your text and fill, I'm going to show you how to do that. Right here, I have open uh, a Word document, an Excel document, and also a PowerPoint document. And I'm gonna show you how you can match the color across all of those. Let's start with the Word document, and let's just say that I wanna use this yellow color and match that across the rest of the, of the documents. What I'm gonna do is right click on the yellow box and then select the Fill option, More Fill Colors, and click on the Custom tab. Here you see an RGB, which is red, green, and blue value. The red is 243, the green is 213, and the blue is 105. So I'm gonna make a note of those numbers, write them down, and then I'm gonna be able to use that exact same color in Excel and in PowerPoint. So let me close out of here, and we'll go over to the Excel spreadsheet. And now let's say I wanna put that yellow color over here where this red square is. So I'm gonna right click there, click the fill button, click on more fill colors, the custom tab, and now I'm gonna replace it with those values, the red, green, blue values of that yellow color, which is 243 for red, 213 for the green, and 105 for the blue. And there, we click OK, and now we have that same yellow color. So same thing, if you go over here to PowerPoint, let's say if you wanna just color that into one of these clouds, you could select the cloud, right click, select the fill box, and do the same thing. Or let's say you want to change the entire theme, color theme of your PowerPoint. The way to do that is to go up here to the Design tab, click on the Variants drop-down where you have your Colors option, and then over here you have all of your custom colors. So you could play around with that. As you can see, as I hover over the different color schemes or theme schemes, the whole thing will change. But let's just say I want to go down and customize that color based on that yellow that I want to bring into this theme. What I want to do is click on Customize Color, and then I look in, into the theme colors and see where that blue is that I want to replace with the yellow. And here I can see it's accent number one. So what I do is I drop down that accent color and click on More Colors, and then I type in my RGB values, which is 243, 213, and 105. And I click OK. And then click Save. And then you can see that the entire theme of the PowerPoint changed based on that primary color of that accent color that I matched to, to match the Word document. So that's a great way that you can look at theme colors. Excel also has theme colors you can see on this calendar. If um, the theme colors you can access in Excel under the Page Layout tab, over here under Themes, Colors, and you can access it there. So you can access the theme colors throughout Microsoft Office depending on what you want to do. And again, all you have to do is click on Customize Colors to match the color. So if you know the RGB value of the color that you want to match, you can absolutely customize that in as a fill color across the Microsoft Office suite. Now, the last thing I want to show you is a nice tool that's in PowerPoint is an eyedropper tool. Say you have a photo that has a color in it that you want to match across uh, the other documents that you're creating. You can go over here to PowerPoint, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to insert a shape um, because I want to find out the RGB value of this color that, say, is in the sunset here. So I'm just going to click a random shape so I have that there. So I'm going to right click, select fill, click on the eyedropper tool, and go over here and select the color tile of the color I want to match. And as you can see, it matches that color up here. Then to get the RGB value, I simply right click, click on fill, more colors, 
and it shows me the RGB value, which is 226, 175, and 157. And now I can take that and go over to, um, let me write that down real quick. It was 226, 175, 157. And let's just say I'm creating an Excel document and I wanna have a merged header row that has that fill color. Then I can click fill, more colors, click on custom and type in 226. 175 and 157. There we go. Now we have the color of our sunset right there in Excel. And if we wanted to type a heading there, we could. So that is how you match colors across Microsoft Office. And uh, if you have any questions or need any help, let me know. Thank you. So be sure to check with your marketing department or find the style guide at your company so that you can match your branded colors in your documents, whether you're creating a quick reference guide or just an Excel spreadsheet or your PowerPoint slides, you can use the same consistent color and branding. It looks more polished and professional. Thanks so much for watching. Be sure to subscribe to my channel and visit my website, SharonSmithHR.com. Thanks for watching.